What's up guys, Cody from Pink Girl here. It is December 9th and I've got something really cool and really unique here at the Bellevue store that I'd like to share with you. I've got something here so unique that I'd venture to say it is the only one of it in existence that's out for retail sale at the moment. Uh, I'll show you that in a bit. But first, three really cool games that I just got in. First up is Shadowrun on the Genesis, which up until researching this game for this video, I always thought was the superior version of the Super Nintendo. Uh, who can say though? It's whatever you grew up with. What is important though is knowing that Shadowrun on the Genesis and Super Nintendo are different games. Yes, uh, the Super Nintendo one, I think it has a little bit better graphics. Uh, they look a little more primitive, but they are much more clean. This one has kind of blocky pixels and stuff. They Characters don't look fully fleshed out, but I think this one, I did give Shadowrun on the SNES a try, and this one seemed a little bit more fun to me, but uh, either way, both of them are worth checking out, because they're both cool games. Next up we have Pirate's Gold, which uh, if anyone has played, what's that called, High Seeds Trader. It's a lot like that, but with a little more fighting and pirates. Um, it's all about trading, uh, building bigger ships, and uh, becoming a better pirate. Uh, pretty cool Genesis game. Both of these, by the way, do come with the instruction manuals. And finally, I've got Dungeon Explorer. Uh, I was looking this game up, and it looks kind of like Smash TV, which, uh, it looks kind of like that, but more, less like a game show, more like uh, Dungeon Explorer. Uh, pretty cool Sega CD game, definitely a, one of the rarer ones. But speaking of rare things, I get asked all the time, how am I going to hook up my 64 to my modern television? So what most people mean by that is that modern televisions do not come with composite inputs anymore and that's the way you hook up your 64. So what do you do about it? You can get like a 10 or $15 adapter from Amazon that isn't going to make the image look any better or you can get the Ultra HDMI video processor mod for the N64. So this mod is really cool. It's actual physical board that you solder onto the N64 motherboard and it produces superior images. So the 64 itself could actually put out much better video but for some reason it didn't. I really don't know all the technicals about it, sorry, but this board takes complete advantage of what the N64 could do. Um, so here, as mentioned earlier, it actually does output via HDMI, although if you choose, you can also do it via AV for whatever reason if you wanted to do that. I mostly do that for side-by-side -side comparisons, which I don't think you'll need. Uh, once you see it display in via the HDMI adapter, or the HDMI mod, you don't really need to see the AV. It's pretty clear that it's the best image you've seen of the 64 so far. Um, here I have Pokemon Snap going, and uh, I was just gonna pull up, there's actually like a, a uh, setup menu. You can change all sorts of settings. Here, one sec, let me screw with the camera, there you go. You can change all kinds of settings, um, and all these settings are documented in an instruction manual that does come with your purchase of an HDMI 64 mod. Um, so yeah. Lots of stuff you can do with it. I can't really go through all the settings right now because there's just too much, but there's much better documentation. As mentioned earlier, um, if you follow this link, you can see how the mod was installed. You can see um, you can see side-by-side uh, -side comparisons of images and videos and all sorts of stuff. Or like I said, you're welcome to just stop into the store and play it yourself. It's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, this thing, I believe it's retailing for $400, just the base 64. It's just got a jumper pack, um, doesn't have a region unlock or anything like that. It's just your mini uh, HDMI cable and the base system. It does, of course, also come with your quick start guide that will explain everything that I can't explain to you. <laughs> so anyway, this is here in the store. I'd love for you guys to come check it out and wonder at its magnificence. So anyway, thanks for watching. See ya.